I've tried on like a variety of like hairs before. You have? I have. Just and to, what did you think? Just, I mean, I could pull it off. Yeah. yeah. I, I could do it. There's. Oh. Yeah. Put this on. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Let's see. All right. Like you can even this out. Oh, you got it pretty well though. Oh, good. So last year at this okay. time, I did a follow-up video to what it has been like since being a bald woman okay. and the ups, the downs, and I got a lot of feedback from male viewers that were like. We want a bald head guy video because it's actually kind of there's there's ups and downs to being a bald headed guy. So I decided. I know you doubt that. I decided. One hundred percent. So I decided to bring my friend Eddie, who, as you can see, is bald, and I wanted to ask him some questions about his experience being a bald headed gentleman, and then inform you of some uplifting, exciting facts. You do not have alopecia. I do not. No. You don't have lupus. You don't have anything. You were just like fuck this. Just Eating hairline, <laughs> I'm gonna shave it, right? It was around like 2010. I was 20 years old. That's so young. I know, I know. I had, I, I had nice hair. Do you think we can insert a photo here of young you? Well, uh, yeah, so around 20 years old was when I started losing it, and um, I decided to not have the, I call it George Costanza. Where That's what I call it too! <laughs> That's what I call it too! Okay, anyways, go on. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, uh, 2010 is when it, it kind of happened. I noticed that my hairline during, you know, my haircuts was getting further and further back. Mm. And I go to the window and I'm looking at my hair like, oh my god, I'm, there's, a, there's a gap, like a, 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 a cul-de-sac. Did you think about like Rogaine or mm. Propecia? My stepdad, he was all the time. He goes, you can just shave it, it's better that way. It's cheaper. And I was like, well, I'm about to lose money. So, <laughs> so yeah, why not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he convinced me to go bald and um, I was in college. That's, yeah, that's great. Like, college is a year where you're transitioning to be an adult. I either have to accept this look or try something else. Mm -hmm. So, okay, you decided <laughs> to shave it. Now, mm -hmm. can I ask you, when your hair is in the in-between stage, how much does it change how you feel? I had an um, audition. Uh huh. They wanted me to not shave for like a whole month. And then they wanted me to come in and then shave it on camera for this whole thing. Mm. I let my hair grow for a month, here and here, and I never felt more insecure in my life because just, just hair here and then a bald spot, just a cul-de-sac in my head, and I was like, I can't deal with this. Did it make you feel older? It did. Yeah. I felt so old, and my hair grew in here, and it came out like patchy, and I was like, this is not what I want to be ever. Mm -hmm. Can you give me a major positive? Okay, well, Go. Bald. It's cheap. I have friends who still have hair, and they spend like 50-ish dollars on haircuts. Well, can you give me a negative? A negative. There are times when I look back, and I think, I wish I had some hair. Because it's, it's, it's nice to have you know, girls, girls you know, run their hands to them, yeah. that's always nice. But nowadays, I think for me, it's mostly just um, a physical thing. So like, if I go shit my head, yeah. and I go to the gym, if I'm sweating in any way, it burns like hell on my head, like it's the worst. Mm. And because all the pores are still open, so all this what's like seeping inside, so it just stings mm -hmm. a lot. But an another one is um, the sun. I went to a uh, tournament in, I think it was Arizona. I, I didn't bring a hat with me. Eddie! And my head was exposed to the sun in like 150, in 115 degree heat. So when I got home, like two days later, I was just like peeling away skin mm. off my head. All right, you ready for some facts to wrap this up? Oh, and I'm gonna see how you feel about these. Oh God. Okay, Eddie, three studies from 2012 on the perception of men who chose to shave their heads found that people related men with shaved heads as stronger, mm. taller, mm. taller shocks me, uh, and more dominant. Okay, when I first started shaving, I was about as skinny as a tripod in this room. <laughs> I was not. I was not. I was not buff in any way. Yeah. So for me, it wasn't. I, I didn't feel like I was stronger. I just felt mm -hmm. like I'm bald now. <laughs> I didn't feel taller. I, mean, I just felt shorter because I had less hair now. Yeah. So. A 1996 paper on the perception and evolutionary significance of baldness okay. states that baldness can be seen as a sign of, and this is more for a historic past, wisdom, authority, and maturity. When I started shaving again, this was 2010, so like eight years ago. Okay. I didn't really feel, what was it, I didn't, I didn't really Wisdom. feel smarter, I didn't really feel authoritative, I didn't, I didn't really feel mature, I just felt like I'm, I'm bald now. But I think as you as, I think as you get older and people start talking to you about it and they and they give you their opinion about it, that's when you start to like gather like, oh, maybe this is a good look for me, I'll, I'll, carry, I'll, I'll yeah. carry out with this now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. People who are bald in movies own things. They, they own do. property. Jason Statham, Professor X. Mr. Clean. Mr. Clean. Michael Jordan, obviously. Jordan, mm-hmm. Um, um, Lex Luthor. Samuel Jackson, for sure. Mm-hmm. Daddy Warbucks. Daddy Warbucks, okay, cool. That's The Rock. The Rock, Rock. oh, yeah. he's bald now and he has a, he has a, 
uh, uh, silver and black. Oh yeah, he's he's crushing it. Oh my god. If you're gonna commit, commit. Do yeah. It. Change is good. Let's be honest. Mm, uh, and I feel yes. like so. If you when I when I went bald, it was like all right, like this the, the, this is a new phase of life. Mm -hmm. It it takes time. Like 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 anything in this world, any, anything you do in this world will take time to get used to. Yeah. Just do. And being bald is one of them. 